All right, today I'm gonna to show you a really cool program that I wrote specifically for your terminal. You can download this code and run it today in your own terminal. It's really awesome, and I'll go into some of the details of how I actually wrote this code. So to start off, you know how there's like music artists out there and they're always like, oh, check out my latest music. It's on you know, Apple Music, Spotify, and streaming on all major platforms. Well, it turns out, Besides programming and tech stuff, I also make music. And I have albums that are available on Spotify and Apple Music and all that stuff. I wanted to do something really fun. I wanted to make my music available on a secret third platform, and that is your own terminal. So I wrote this program that you can download, run on your machine, and you can listen to my album. So I'll show you how this works. So we run bash and then we give it the single argument. We curl nightfall.ysap.sh. Nightfall is the name of my album. Ysap.sh is the name of my website. We go ahead and we run this and watch what happens. Look at this. It's just straight up a music player in your terminal. So up, down arrow keys work. You can use JK as if you're in Vim. And then when you want to listen to a song, you hit enter and it starts playing. Music just starts playing. How awesome is that? Oh, you want to listen to a different song? Cool. Let's go down here and let's listen to maybe Echoes of Solace. So now we start playing that song. When the song's over, it'll automatically jump onto the next song in the album. And when the final song's done, it'll stop. So you can listen to the album from start to finish just by going to the first song and clicking enter. Oh man, this song's good. So yeah, I also make piano music. It's available online. You can download it right here. You can run it in your own terminal. And when you're done, control C. And it's gone. There you go. And you have this little link right here. So you view the source code or download the album. So if you want to, you can pull the source code. You can listen to the album. That way you can go download all my music, whatever you want. So if you're curious how this works, I would say go to the website in your browser or you can just curl it yourself. And when you curl this, of course, you just get a bash script. So this is how it's all rendered. I would invite you all to go look through this. It was a ton of fun writing this. If you know how I write code, you know I like to make big giant block comments that explain what's going on. So an entire synopsis of how the program works is here. And if people are interested, I could do like a future video where I break down how this actually works. Um, but yeah, check it out. There you go. You can stream my latest album or well, second latest album in your terminal today. How fancy is that?